The East End of Toronto is one of Canada's most diverse neighbourhoods. For over 90 years, Michael Guerin Hospital has been serving the broad spectrum of the community's healthcare needs with compassion and professionalism. In 2018, MGH and their partners, including Infrastructure Ontario, broke ground on an ambitious redevelopment project which centred around a new state-of-the-art eight-storey patient care tower to serve the needs of the growing community. The Cannon Maryland Thompson Patient Care Centre has proudly reached interim completion. This is a major milestone in the project, which means that the hospital will now have full access to the new space to begin preparing for occupancy. So this is a much needed redevelopment of our campus that includes eight stories of patient care, two outdoor terraces, one for our mental health program, also for our staff, wider hallways and larger footprint for uh, bedrooms and for uh, patient care areas, more natural light, uh, which offers a much better healing environment. So the inpatient capacity is going to be 215 new beds, 80% of which are going to be private. Even the double occupancy rooms, however, will have uh, toilets and bathroom facilities uh, for every uh, patient. Really bringing world-class environment for our world-class healthcare team to be able to provide really patient-centered care in a much brighter and newer environment. Seeing this project come to fruition has really energized not only the team, but also the community. And really this highlights the roll up your sleeves type of attitude that Michael Guerin Hospital brings to uh, any project. Uh, we have commitment and passion, not only for caring for our community, but also bringing the same enthusiasm to a project like this, because everyone really realized that this is part of our future. Working with Infrastructure Ontario throughout the process has really uh, felt very much like a partnership. We've uh, relied on Infrastructure Ontario for counsel, for very balanced advice, they were at the table whenever we needed to do some negotiation. This really is about people and it's not just steel and bricks and mortar but it's really about healthcare workers, care providers and patients.